Hi everyone, my name is Melinda from the European Pain Federation EFIC. I'm here today with Andre Moreau, the chair of the EFIC Grants and Prices Committee, to tell us a little bit more about the EGG, the EFIC Grunenthal Grant. Uh, Andre, can you uh, tell us more about the jury and their background? Yeah, so the, the jury, there are 13 members of the jury. You can actually find um, their name on the EGG uh, website if you want to really know their specific expertise. But so this, this jury was set up uh, basically so that uh, taken together, we would have the expertise required to evaluate all the applications that we receive. So many of the jury members are MDs um, with various uh, specialties, uh, neurologists like myself, uh, anesthetists uh, also, um, also uh, MDs specialized in, in or with strong expertise in pharmacology, but we also have uh, non-MDs like biomedical engineers and uh, psychologists. Wonderful. And uh, what are the most important factors to the jury when they are judging an application for the EGG? Yeah, so this was actually uh, discussed beforehand since uh, all the applications will be uh, reviewed by uh, uh, some reviewers and so to make sure that we, we have the we apply the same criteria to, to evaluate uh, uh, the different applications. So basically the um, evaluation criteria, there are four of them. The first is the strength of the applicant, uh, which would be based on the CV of the applicant and also information on their previous uh, research work. The second uh, criterion is the novelty uh, of the research. Uh, so how novel is the project? Um, is the scope of the project covered well by existing research? Uh, is this a field that requires uh, further investigation? The third uh, criterion is the quality uh, of the proposal. Uh, so uh, based on the description of the, the methodology, the, the study design, the problem, the proposed intervention, uh, so this is the third criterion. And then a fourth criterion that we decided to include, which uh, we think is uh, also an important criterion, is feasibility. So uh, here we will score the application based on the feasibility of the project. Is it feasible? Uh, can the objectives of the project uh, be fulfilled based on available resources, time provided, availability of patients, um, etc.? And so these are the four criteria. Uh, that will be used to, to evaluate each, uh, each application, beyond, of course, the eligibility criteria, which um, uh, are also um, yeah, described on the EGG website. Thank you so much, Andre. That was very helpful. Do you know uh, what are the next steps in the EGG? What is the process in the future now? Yes, of course. So the, the first important deadline is uh, the 30th of September. So that's the deadline for submitting an application. And then the, the review process is scheduled between October uh, and December. So we expect to be finished with the review process at the end of this year, uh, meaning that we will be able to announce the results uh, in January 2022 uh, at latest.